Hello everybody, I am Brayman19 and welcome to episode 28 of our Commonwealth camp. Well, actually it's our Polish campaign, but we're now the Commonwealth in Europe and Versailles 4 as we are still going for our three achievements. We actually have one achievement already knocked off. Actually two achievements and one of them I was not even meaning to get. Uh, they are multiculturalism, have four different cultures and four different religions represented in your court. And then one king to rule as Poland become an absolute uh, absolutist monarchy, abolishing the Sejm, which we kind of were, you know, very nice to get that one. We're still going after two of them. One of them is winged hussars, which I think we might get this time through. We have to have winged hussars as our active unit and more than plus 50% combat cavalry ability. I already have the combat cavalry, uh, our cavalry combat ability. I just need to get winged hussars unlocked. And then the other one is... I just want to see why is it 34 okay that's HRE crap I didn't know I'm not in the HRE and I don't really care uh, what they have to do and then uh, let's see where 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 I think I passed over it come on where is it Poland came into space there it is as Poland reached the maximum level in all technologies which is 32 we're at 21 right now so we probably have another you know, 15, 20 episodes to go before we actually get there. And in there, there's a lot of fun that can be had. Um, you know, I think I, I think the biggest thing is, like I said, my main goals for territory is to knock out the Ottomans. And I'll probably knock out Hungary and just own everything that's part of my mission tree. I want all of my mission tree completed. If, if I don't get it, I'm not going to get too mad. But I would just really love that. Um, and the HRE is one of my guys. Once imperialism is part of a, is part of this, we're gonna fight. So, anyways, let's go ahead and jump on in here and play it. And let's go. Let's see here. Also, I think I need to go ahead and make a mention that this is on Twitch. You're welcome to go check out the link in the description below. Uh, Kristov is somebody who just followed me as well as Doctor jo uh, Joseph or Joseph One. Appreciate that, guys. Hope you guys enjoy the stream. You come and follow, you'll find out whenever I go live. That's all the fun of it. Anyways, let's take a look. I have an army template I can go ahead and post out there. I think I should. Let's do it here. I call it 34 because that's how that's my force limit right now. I don't, is it going to go up with the next... Yeah, see 34, but let me see if the next tech level... Plus 2. Yeah, I'll need to actually increase it at that point. So Beskian army reforms actually gives us morale, army, mil uh, military power, and admin power. I'll take that. I am a little low on that military power. There's so many like good little events that you know Poland and the Commonwealth get. Things I just wasn't expecting. Could I add? No, I think I need to focus my next bits on getting. Uh, these guys up to their next combat uh, value. Let me see what that would that is again. Thirty six. So this could be. No, they are at thirty six. Ah. So they're already ready to go. Um. Have only five. In each, don't I? Let's give him five. Okay, that's five of them in there. The Heretics of Hum switched over to us. Um, it's gonna cost me 6.76, but we're near the end of our list, so hey. It's all good. Requests from Pomerania, they're fighting Munster. Yeah, no. Nah. Yeah, the HRE is really fighting amongst themselves, and it's really just like Poland. Or actually, it's just. <laughs> Saxony and uh, I think it's Cyprus. Is that Cyprus? Yes. So if I can find a way just to fight Saxony, you know, which has some strong folks, Bohemia included, I need to find like maybe Bavaria is the route. Home Flanders, Utrecht, yeah. And then that will bring in Cyprus, and I just got to go siege down their uh, capitals, and they're done. No more HRE. We can then just attack freely into whoever we wish. You know, I could get that sweet, nice development over here, which would then help me fight the uh, Russians if I ever needed to, which I will probably need to. Also, I really want that Hungary to be gone. I think if I own like a line up through here, 
I'd be pretty happy. Royal marriage on Moldavia again. Definitely want to keep that going. Now, could I get another leader? Or am I at my, li I'm at my limit? No, I can definitely get another one. Royal marriage with the Spain is over, but there we go. A little extra. Spend a little bit, but I mean, we're almost there. 391, yeah, we'll be there in a month or two. Then we just need to wait for the, the head of time penalty to go away. Because we definitely want to save some. There's Ulm fighting Bre Bremen and Siena. What's he at? 21. We're at 21 as well. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. Yeah, the levels, most of these guys are at 21. Military tech. I don't really care about the rest. The rest of it, you know, we start fighting him and he'll fall down further. There we go. Now then, Winged Hussars. That will, we'll go ahead and knock this achievement out. We'll go ahead and do this one too. Okay. Now then, let's go change this unit type here. Winged Hussars, and that should be another one done. Um, Saxon infantry is all I can do. Swivel Cannon to Cohorn Mortar. Let's take a look at our achievements now. There it is, Winged Hussars. Have Winged Hussars as your active unit with more than plus 50% cavalry combat ability. So that's two of three done. That's two of the ones that we were searching for to get done. Now we just need one more. And that's going to come late, so we can't do anything about that. Now, Diplo or Economic? I like Diplo, because it can still use this Diplo tech cost. So let's go ahead and do this. And we'll try to... I don't really care about the Diplomats, I care about the Diplomatic Relations. So... Mm, Ottomans in Delhi against Hassa? Nah, I'm not going to... Yeah, it's this guy down here. Why would you do that? Unless they attacked you. Yeah, attacker against Timurids. If only the uh, if only Great Britain and Russia would leave him. Even if just Russia would leave him, I could beat him with Great Britain. I want to get rid of their friendship. That's all I care about. Spain? España. There we go. Take this, do 6.8. Take a look here. Yeah, that's still about the same. I could add about 21 units with four armies. Um, I just really wish I could declare that war. I can't. Just gotta wait. Allow client states an advanced Cassus Belly. Global settler increase, colonial range, things that just don't affect me. At least really do. We get more Patrine infantry here, military contact, uh, tactics, cavalry shock, and improved flanking. And then we get development efficiency and administrative. Okay. Some nice things. Uh, this cost me 120. We'll do it. Cost me 804 for those 30 ships. I do need to start looking at universities, or more of them. Yeah, no states can be turned over now. Yep, take that Diplo. It's that next one that we want really badly. Now, Burgers are disloyal. Poznan and Torontal all have a little bit, but they're not really going to be rising up, I don't believe. If you think about it, I kind of do have like one of some of the best diplomatic relations in the game right now. France, Spain, Austria, Bohemia, Moldavia is on my side. I mean, I have a huge territory. Russia has the Ottomans, which is really... The thing is, this Russia is Russia. 
that's the worst thing about him. Uh, Great Britain, it's got a few, including the Ottomans. The Ottomans are really, they have the second best, I think. With Sind, they have Delhi in there with them. They have Killa as well. I think they have the, probably the second best relations. I think 1v1 we could beat them, but it's so hard to fight so many people in so many different areas, especially with the AI is not super smart about things. Memmingen Mains. Men's? Mines? I think that's how it said mines. I still won't call it mains. We're at 154,000 manpower. Prestige is still negative, but it's almost done. We're at 89 legitimacy. No Ming, I do not want to. Who is, how is Ming even doing in this game? They're all right. I mean, they're not great. Turco-Polish tension is going to give me more manpower, about 18,000 more. Who do you dislike? You do not like Russia. You don't like Vijanagar and Bengal. Your ally with Anu and Boratania. Boratia, whatever. The Ottomans have picked Cherson. I don't even know where that's at. Oh, this thing right here. If they wanted to attack, I mean, they they would probably do it with some help. Okay. Um, let's add five per. You get five. You get five. I should have probably done this before. They, we got that sweet uh, extra um, manpower. Just done as much of this as I could have. We need to add two more. There's one. Need one more. And then I need to do that guy down there in uh, Greece. Our cause is just aggressive expansion. Okay, cool. Well, we didn't really need that, but we'll take it. Um, yep, we're going to do this one. He's point four unity. Once those are all done, I'm not going to really care. We're actually losing money now. Not good. Could take out a loan, do what I need to do, and then because we're going to be going to war very shortly. Military leader left us. Up oh, there's the war. Spain's fighting all those guys. Yeah, fine. Not expecting a real fight, so. You see what Spain's looking at. Get a new leader here. He's all right. Only losing negative point zero eight. I think we can live with it. We'll go on the defensive down here. Hopefully we can break their guarantee of some folks. That would be kind of cool. Showing superiority in the Spanish Crusade against Antamaro. Negative point six nine. How goes that? You're almost at fifty percent, and you're costing me like seven ducats a turn. So we could wait that out. Okay. It'll be done 1678 in like six, seven months. We just actually got money there. Because somebody died. Okay, we'll wait till we'll wait a few months. I could go raiding. We'll let you sit on that if you want. 
There goes Mutapa. Were they sitting on Antimora or something? Yeah, they're already down right here. Cyprus was re-elected. Yeah, I can't afford to get a new guy anyway. And my ships can't help you there, Spain. I'm sorry. You got 45, though, hanging around. Like, right there they are. 49. That's enough to beat him, I think. There you go. Let's see if we can get a guy. Even like a level 1 missionary strength guy is fine. Okay, how much am I making? 6.23. Ideally, I need 6.86. We'll wait it out for a little bit. Yep, Spain, you can use our ways through. Stuff that. I could go active in this war, but I just don't feel like. It. I mean, I guess. Let's go back up Spain. Why not, right? We can go raid. Um, Ministry of Efficiency? Is that a cost thing? Might help. Plus five. 6.27 to what? 5.67 went down. <laughs> Not good. I hope I never drink any of that bad stuff. Um, it's alright, we're gonna bleed this place dry. Let's go ahead and He is going to pay for us to turn places to our control. Let's go to Al Raqqa. Go to Sinjar. Send you as far as I can. I'll send you to Marden. Okay, you can do this one. Diplo relations. There we go. That sir, that solves one little problem. There you go. Yeah, that's gonna get it back. It's okay. You need to fin wrap it up, buddy. Yeah, there's no money back. We'll sit there. Hama. I'll send you over here. I'll pull you there and you there. Just trying to force the Mamluks out. There's some over here working. I, I'm not really wor too worried about it. We'll let him think he's winning. Those ohms. Now 
Mamlex is still high. I feel good. Even though we're going all through here now. I really don't have any things that anything that I want from him. It's really just about helping an ally in this one. More trust, more favors. That's all I'm after. Go ahead and win this, man. 14%. You can do it. Now, Mamluks are getting like three-star generals, too. Forty-two percent. They do have the wall breach. So that's cool for them. Come on, send me down here. Going to Gaza. There's Moldavia. He's down. He ran all the way down there to their capital. Good little vassal. Siege of Iskandria is now done. Assassination of a noble will lose 25, get 10 loyalty still. Go to Azrak. He's sending 20. He's got men up there running, but I don't think he's going to have much choice. Go on and take to book. I mean, just another. We need to be doing it. Nope. Didn't mean to send you by sea. We're at negative 14. He's at negative 14. Just take the capital. Let's build ships. Let's do 8.51. Take the money. I know I'm not feeling it, am I? No, Moldavia is, but Moldavia, you just need to take win this siege. There it goes. Let's take their more expensive stuff. There goes Mamlux. Calls for peace. I'm done with it. I don't have to worry about it. There you go. Another two-star general. And there goes that war over with. Fine. Use 15 favors. Um, let's do some development real quick. Yeah, because there's really nothing else I can spend it on. So, um. Hmm.
Let's kind of start at the bottom of the list. There you go. A little bit extra attacks everywhere. Making money, we're making 26.72 now. Papal States attacking the Ottomans, I guess? Attacker against the Papal State. So I guess, what is he doing, I wonder? Are you trying to take Salento? I don't know. Austria is fighting off against Venice and all of them. Yeah, we'll accept it, but I'm not going to really do anything. We'll send you down this way. I guess some of my ships were caught out. Must have been. I think I lost third, all of my ships. I sure did. I lost all of my ships. Well, they shouldn't have been sitting here anyway. I should have brought them around. That's on me. 30 versus 51. I have no clue how many I even beat. He still has over 50. Um, I think we got enough allies to help him here. Or he's gonna there's enough to do this on his own. Yeah, Provence is in it too, but Provence will go. Alright guys, well I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode right here. I think we've been going on long enough. Um it's just a matter of time. That's really what it is. It's a it's a short matter of time to uh see this through. 3, 2, 4, and 10. That's right. Let's do one there. Five there. There you go. And all we gotta do is just keep going. Once we get Imperialism, we'll be able to fight Saxony. Saxony will bring in Cyprus. We'll just invade Cyprus. I mean, that's really all it comes down to. Ending out that war will, uh... Because I think Saxony is still the only... No, there's more electors now. Alsace and Hesse. But all we gotta do is just go and hold all of their capitals at one time. Dismantle the HRE, and then the HRE is no more, and we can use our, we can just fight anybody we want to. So, all right, guys, appreciate y'all so much for watching. Do not forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Maybe check the link for Discord in the description below, and I'll see you all next time.